Meet Daisy, she's got a way of making beautiful things. Never know what nature will teach her what inspiration will bring. D-O-Y-D-O-Y -Daisy, Daisy, what are we making today? D-O-Y-D-O-Y -Daisy, Daisy, I bet. Gumboot Kids. Hi, Daisy. I've been picking lavender all morning. <sighs> I just love the smell of lavender. It's so soothing and relaxing. And I was inspired to make a nature craft. Would you like to make a lavender bunch with me, Gumboot Kids? Yay! Step one. Collect some fresh lavender, sage, grasses, and even roses from a garden. What a lovely smell. Step two, now place your lavender bunch into a lovely little arrangement in a jar. Here you are. Remember, there's no right or wrong way to make a nature craft. I love making nature crafts. I love lavender. It's such a pretty color. It smells so good. Step three, now take your bouquet out of the jar and tie string around the stems. Make it nice and snug. Now add some colorful ribbons or wool. Here's your ribbon. Can you please help me tie my ribbon? Like this? Yes, like that. Thank you. Lovely gumboot kids, great teamwork. And voila, a lavender bunch. Ooh, look. What a lovely smell. Okay, Gumboot Kids, let's see what you've made. <laughs> Lavender bunches will look and smell wonderful while they're fresh, and even as they dry out over time. They're a nice way to remember the summer all year round. I'm going to hang mine above the kitchen sink so I can smell my lavender bunch while I'm doing the dishes. And I'll give this one to my friend Scout. <laughs> See you next time, Gumboot Kids. Goodbye, Daisy. D-O-Y-D-O-Y, Daisy, what are we making today?